कूल एंड टेम्परेचर सेंसर एंड दिस इज अवर प्रोसेसर इंजिन प्रोसेसर ई सी एम प्रोसेसर एंड दिस इज अवर सिस्टम मीन्स वैन यू टर्न ऑफ द इग्निशन एंड ऑन द इग्निशन इट्स डजेंट मैटर इफ यू कनेक्टेड द बैटरी सो इट विल बी शो हेयर ट्वेल्व वोल्टेज सो टी सिक्स एटी फाइव विल कनेक्टेड टू अवर सिस्टम आई सी डिग्री सेल्सियस सो इफ दिस प्रोसेसर गेट नाइनटी डिग्री सेल्ट सो दिस प्रोसेसर कमांड टू सिस्टम आई सी हैव अवेल्व वोल्टेज हेयर एंड इफ यू कनेक्टेड दिस रजिस्टेंस इट वोल्ट और टू वोल्ट ऑल्सो डायरेक्ट so first you have to know that relay and the wiring of this relay and after that you know that what is the sensors and uses of sensors and how to check and the sensors line from processor and processor to system ic and system ic to ec so you have to all this knowledge fellow bomb fellow bomb Hello everyone this is Ozil welcome back to my channel so in this video i am going to teach you how electrical radiator fan work and how to diagnose this fault okay and what types of knowledge you have to know then you will be repair ecm okay so in olden time we have seen the radiator fan will attach to the water pump or direct attach to the uh crank shaft or cam shaft pulley okay mostly uh, the crank shaft connected to the uh, drive belt and it will be a uh, rotated by a drive belt to cr uh, crank shaft okay so let's i am going to explain how electrical circuit work in the ecus and how command the ecu and how it work okay so here we have a coolant temperature sensor and this is our processor engine processor ecm processor and this is our system ic and this is the low speed radiator fan relay this is high speed radiator fan relay and this one is the motor radiator fan motor okay now how it's working just see first i am going to uh, mark this relay this pin number is 87 and 30 this one is 87 and this one is 30 okay now you can see here pin number 86 87 both are connected to one 60 ampere fuse this 60 ampere fuse and it will come from battery it will come from battery battery okay and this one is always hot hot means what hot at all time it means when you turn off the ignition and on the ignition it's doesn't matter if you connected the battery so it will be show here 12 voltage so that's why we called hot at all time hot at all time okay so this 12 voltage stay continuously 12 voltage here if you connected the bat okay and this one this relay have also pin number 85 and 86 85 86 and 85 okay so pin number 80 86 or 86 both are connected each other and it will come through 10 ampere fuse after that it will come from main relay main relay 12 volt okay so i have told in many videos first you turn on the ignition on the time 12 voltage come inside the board and ground out to on the main relay after that main relay on then 12 voltage also come in the ecm then our ecm will be on fully so this 12 voltage also goes to this radiator fan relay pin number relay number uh, relay pin number 86 and 86 so it will be a input to relay okay this one is input okay so this is the main thing it will be a continue if you turn on the ignition on the time it will be a 12 voltage here okay now this 86 85 will connected to our system ic system ic means what we have a this ecm and this ecm is connected 
through your connector and it will be a come from system IC same as it is this is connected to the system IC and this pin number also connected to the system IC so how I just take it so this one is also connected to the system IC and how it works so here we have a coolant temperature sensor so coolant temperature sensors have one resistance another resistance this resistance is pull up and this one is connected to our processor it will TC 1762 maybe anything okay so it will connect it to here and this one is also ground from ECM so if the uh, this coolant temperature sensor sense the water temperature inside the engine and this one send the signal to the processor so processor will get the signal the temperature temperature of uh, water in engine water in engine for example it is sense 90 degree celsius so if this processor get 90 degree celsius out uh, in the coolant temperature coolant temperature coolant so this processor command to system ic so system ic command to system ic on that time this will out ground to low radiator fan this one so it have already 12 voltage main relay 12 voltage and now it will get a 90 degree celsius this processor command to system ic and system ic out ground to this relay so this have a coil both have a coil if here have a 12 voltage and this is the uh, negative voltage from the system ic it will the uh, it will uh, magnetize and it will get a magnetize on the time 87 and 30 will connect each other it will connect or short so it will connect and this voltage out to this 12 voltage out to this motor radiator fan motor and this radiator fan motor have one resistance so suppose you have a 12 voltage here and if you connected this resistance it will uh, it means it will take one volt or two volt depend on manufacturer okay so suppose we have we have here 11 volt on the motors so the, uh, this speed will be reduced because this voltage will not sufficient so um, whenever this voltage if this voltage getting the low on the time it will be it will speed also slowly so that's why we say that if i connected the one resistance to uh, motors it will be a reduce the current okay so it will this that's why we call the low speed and if this processor sends outside temperature outside coolant temperature above the 100 degree celsius on the time this processor again command to system ic and this system ic stop this ground and command to this relay so this relay have also 85 have a 12 voltage main relay and 86 sorry 86 have a 12 voltage 85 have a system ic commanded to ground so this is a ground and this is a positive it means this have a coil so it will be a magnetized and this 87 12 voltage hot at all time it will connect here 30 and this 30 travel from here and it will go directly to the motor it will go directly to the motor and the ground will constant it will be always connected if there you have uh, uh, the ground will not connected via relay it will connect directly okay it will directly so that's why you supply the low voltage it will be a, a, a low speed and if you connected here so there is a no resistance between motors and relay so the 12 direct 12 voltage will get this motor and it will be a uh, on with full speeds so this is the processor uh, this is the full process to diagnose so this whole circle if if your mechanic your electrician will say that our when i turn on the ignition on the time our uh, radiator fan will get direct or if i connect the uh, connected the uh, radiator um, uh, ecm socket on the time it will also direct 
सो फर्स्ट यू हैव टू नो दैट जो द वर्किंग ऑफ दिस मोटर दिस रिले एंड द वायरिंग ऑफ दिस रिले एंड आफ्टर दैट यू नो दैट वॉट इज द सेंसर्स एंड यूजेस ऑफ सेंसर्स एंड हाउ टू चेक एंड द सेंसर्स लाइन फ्रॉम प्रोसेसर एंड प्रोसेसर टू सिस्टम आई सी एंड सिस्टम आई सी टू ई सी सो यू हैव टू ऑल दिस नॉलेज इफ यू डोंट हैव दिस नॉलेज यू कैन डू एनी थिंग एंड इफ देर इज अ समटाइम्स आई हैव सीन थर्मोस्टेट वॉल हैव क्लोज थर्मोस्टेट वॉल्स हैव गेट फॉल्टिंग ऑन द टाइम दिस कूलेंट टेम्परेचर सेंसर विल नॉट गेटिंग द कूलेंट वॉटर सो इट विल नॉट सेंस द वोल्टेज इट विल नॉट सेंस द टेम्परेचर टू सेंड दिस प्रोसेसर ऑन द टाइम ऑल्सो ऑलवेज गेट द हाई ऑलवेज गेट द हाई कूलेंट लाइट ग्लोइंग हाई कूलेंट लाइन और लो कूलेंट लाइन एंड द रेडिएटर फ्लो द आउटसाइड वाटर सो इट विल बी ऑलवेज गेट सर यू हैव टू यू हैव ऑल्सो नो द मैकेनिकल नॉलेज इफ यू डोंट हैव अ मैकेनिकल नॉलेज और इलेक्ट्रिकल नॉलेज यू कैंट सर्वाइव दिस लाइन सो यू हैव टू गेट द प्रॉपर नॉलेज ऑफ इलेक्ट्रीशियन हाउ टू वर्क दिस वन दिस वन दिस वन एंड दिस वन देन यू विल इंटर यू विल बी इंटर इन सिस्टम्स प्रोसेसर एंड सिस्टम आई सी इफ यू डोंट हैव अ दिस नॉलेज सो यू डिडेंट इंटर फर्स्ट यू हैव टू कलेक्ट दिस नॉलेज देन यू कम इन साइड द ईस्यू ओके आई होप यू गेट नॉलेज फ्रॉम माई वीडियो इफ यू गेट द नॉलेज फ्रॉम माई वीडियो प्लीज डू लाइक शेयर एंड सब्सक्राइब टू माई चैनल एंड इफ यू डिडेंट विजिट अवर वेबसाइट गो एंड विजिट देयर रैमजॉन डायोट इन एंड यू कैन गेट ऑल द all the answers of your questions okay about the files about the pinouts about whatever about whatever you can go and search and find out you can get many more you just and you can also download from the google um, uh, google our website uh, uh, apps so thank you thanks for watching